So right off the bat, this is not a political video. It's Sunday and I'm not American. So I don't really have any place to spout opinions on this matter. So if you're clicking on videos looking for affirmation on what you think about the Texas tragedy, I've got bad news here. However, what I do enjoy is watching programmable people carry out orders they've received from the television so they can give the Democratic Party a free campaign advert. I enjoy this very much. What's now playing in the background is an assortment of manatees and unattractive women seething and losing their minds at the still ongoing NRA convention protest. Because as we all know, how to win the hearts and minds of the undecided is to look completely insane and target an organisation that had nothing to do with anything. If only someone had decided to control that one chick's eating. Imagine how happy and healthy she might have been instead of sweating profusely because she's speaking. Here's another 2 out of 10 shrieking. I think we might be seeing a pattern forming here, boys. Here's another 1 out of 10. Pattern confirmed, really exemplifying the mindset of an NPC, where when asked why they don't like something, they have no idea. They were just told to dislike it and never questioned it. They're on the wrong side of history, and history will not remember them kindly. Do you know what group that was over there? Those were the Proud Boys. What do, you, what do they stand for? They stand for, uh, honestly, I really don't even like thinking about what they stand for. Um, they stand for... And, you know, whether they want to fight it or not, they stand for racist, sexist, um, all the ism ideologies that, like, so it's like, they got all the isms, they got all the icks, everything. Oh, yeah, all the ism ideologies, they stand for all of them. I don't care about the Proud Boys, by the way, they also seem to be idiots, but this really does highlight how dumb these people are. They just know to hate something, they don't know why they should hate it. Literal NPC behaviour, having a command written into their code. It's so great. So we've been focusing on ugly women for the duration of this video, and I agree, this is painful on the eyes, and maybe a little bit unfair. But worry not, my friend, the NPC comes in beta a male specification as well. Let's see one of these fine specimens in action. You're weak. You're weak. You'll always be weak. You need a gun because you're 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 weak. You need a bullhorn because your voice is small. You need a Hmm, calling others weak while visibly struggling to hold up a piece of paper and your voice breaking might not be the own you think it is, little buddy. But now for the coup de grace, the chef's kiss, if you will. The finest star of an NPC. The man so dedicated to carrying out his orders, he is willing to go above and beyond to get his master's message of vote Democrat in November across. Let's see this champion among men. Enough is enough! Enough, enough, is, enough. is enough! Enough is enough! Enough is enough! This little NPC nearly made himself pass out when he read too much. Can you imagine being so weak and so beta? You can nearly make yourself unconscious merely by speaking. And all these years I thought the literally shaking and crying meme was just that, a meme. But no, it seems these fools actually do it. And as a side note, and you can interpret this how you like, but it would be interesting to see how many of these pronouns were protesting the Roe versus Wade over 10 and when that was what they were ordered to be angry about, wouldn't it? That's it for today's video. Don't forget to like and share, subscribe to see more content like this. Thanks, boy.